Thank y'all for tuning in, it's your boy Global Mall. Today we're gonna talk about the different beaches in the tourist area. Everybody knows about Cocobana Beach, but me, I like Ipanema Beach. It's more of local people, you got a younger crowd, it's a nice vibe, beautiful women, and like I say, man, you got less hagglers over there, you know what I'm saying? Nah, nah. What, I'm, what I'm trying to say is people who be begging you, like, I like, I don't like people begging me when I'm on trips. I want to enjoy my trip, not spend too much money. I mean, I don't mind spending money on things I like to do, but I'm, I'm tired. I'm tired of going from country to country and everybody just wants something from me, you know what I'm saying, without doing anything for me. So I recommend you go to Empanema Beach, you know what I'm saying. And Cocobana Beach is cool too. You know, it's the main beach, the most popular beach here, but I, I, it's more of a family vibe. If you're looking for a more family vibe, go to Cocobana Beach, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of good restaurants out there. It's, it's a lot of uh, little sand castles with a little artwork to it. It's a lot of people selling stuff, but you, you definitely gonna get harassed out there. They're definitely gonna be pressing you to buy something, you know what I'm saying? Me, I don't be with all that. I just want to chill and enjoy my trip. You know what I'm saying? So I'm definitely prefer Empanema Beach. It's late. It's late. Like, yeah, fellas. Y'all y'all definitely fellas, y'all think we laid Empanema Beach. Check that one out over Coco Bonnet. They both cool, but yeah. Empanema Beach most definitely. Um Oh, it seems like a lot of people are in shape in Brazil. Like for y'all, for y'all fellas, I think y'all need to go ahead and get your body right before you slide down here. You know what I'm saying? Cause yeah, those women are definitely in shape. I see more women in shape than out of shape women. Even the dudes, even the dudes be looking good. They be in shape too. Niggas rocking around here with eight packs and all that. I'm like, damn, that's motivation. I gotta get in the gym. You know what I'm saying? And they definitely say you would be in the gym before carnival come, cause everybody gonna be outside swinging. So shit, yeah, yeah. So you ain't gotta worry about seeing too many out of shape people on the beach. You know what I'm saying? You gonna see some sexy things out there, most definitely. But yeah, but that that's my intake on the beaches around here. Now the city, the city is lit. Like Rio is lit. Like I recommend you come out here. Like according to what you like to do, I know what I like to do. I like to party. You know what I'm saying? I like to party. I like to eat good. I like to meet new people. I like to go on tours. I like to eat. Hell, I even like gym hopping. Like going to the gym. I love working out. You know. So in the area I'm staying is in Panema. I'm staying. I like to stay at um, Tiffany's. It's like a, a apartment hotel. You know what I'm saying? And it also is guest friendly for y'all boys that like the brain. You know what I'm saying? Your guests with you, your chicks, your your pros or whatever you want to call it. it this, this is a good building for that. That's another thing I need to talk about. A lot of these places out here won't let you bring any company or any guests like that, especially with this COVID thing going. So you want to make sure before you book your place to stay that you find out if it's guest friendly that you can bring a chick or uh, even a guest period because a lot of people ain't allow on that. But yeah, the area I like to stay in is Empanema. You know what I'm saying? It's a lot of restaurants. You don't have to worry about a restaurant, finding a good restaurant to eat at. You don't have to worry about a grocery store. I, I even seen a 24 hour grocery store. You know what I'm saying? So definitely, definitely check out Empanema. And it's like, it's a, it's a road. It has plenty of shopping. I don't know it's the exact name of the road, but it's like maybe two blocks away from the beach. So you, you definitely have a lot of places to shop at. And I recommend that you get like a, a SIM card for the country, like Claro. You go to Claro, you get your SIM card so you can um, call when you want to, make all the little calls you need to make, you know what I'm saying? Because most phones don't work out here. Uh, if you got Verizon like me, the Verizon gonna charge you ten dollars a day. So I recommend going you get you a SIM card while you're in the area. And um, they got a lot of pharmacies if you need medication for any little thing. So you won't have to worry about finding a pharmacy. Now ATMs, they have a lot of ATMs, but they don't really take certain cards like I bank with, like Navy Federal. Wells Fargo, some places, a lot of places didn't take that, so I had to find a Pacific ATM to pull and withdraw money out, so that's another thing. I recommend before you get here, you let your bank know that you're going to be here so you, your cards can actually work, so you don't have to run into no mishap. Me, I like to exchange money at the bank, or I like to go to the ATM to pull money out. 
I never, I never, ever exchange money at the airport because it's too damn high. They gonna try to get you. Everybody trying to get you at the airport. So yeah, wait till you get in the city to do all your money exchanging. And, and don't try to exchange money with people on the street. I recommend the bank or the ATM because they will get you. You know what I'm saying? And you don't know if the money fake. The hell, people around here will give you fake money. Not just this country, all countries. You know what I'm saying? They gonna get over you a gringo. You don't know no better. So they looking for a free liquor come up. Everybody doing some type of scamming. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, that's pretty much it, man. I thank y'all for tuning in. Tap in with me, Global Mall, Global Production Channel. Yeah.